Hi there, everyone. This is Mailman Zero playing Low G Man. All right, Ocean Depths. Now I'm in the water, and the physics is identical. And I guess I have to claw my way out of the water. I gotta climb up these guys or something. I wish I had more jumping ability. Or no. Do I go down more? Oh, that's I don't know why. It just seemed like it's a vertical level. It just seemed like I was supposed to go down more. I, and I'm failing miserably. What is this? Can't do anything. Falling to the death. Down. Oh. I just want some power-ups. Wow, I'm up to 26. That's the most I've ever had, I think. I should really stop dying. That's, that's, that's a good idea, don't you think? I mean... Wow, that was awesome. So if I continue, where does it continue me at? Right here, so I'll just keep going. So I'll have no power-ups at all. So if you know what to do, you can go down really fast, I guess. You just have to move so that you don't land on anything. And not get hit in the face by uh, stuff down here. And if you go the wrong way, of course, then you run into those... Uh, those spiky things. They're like, uh, water landmines. Like, I don't know if I can even hit them. So this is just a coiled up snake guy under the water. Like, snake rope. I'm just gonna keep trying this and see if anything happens to me. If he stays up there, then I'm good. If he comes down farther, then I'm probably dead. But, uh, for now this seems to be working. Okay, that didn't work so well. I don't know who designed this guy, but honestly, I've gotten hit twice and I haven't even tried to not get hit. He ran right into me and it didn't hit me. That's some awesome hit detection right there. Come on, keep coming. You gotta come down low enough that you, I can hit you, but I don't want you to hit me when you do that. See, I really don't know what's expected of him here. Because he comes down low enough for me to hit him, but at the same time he hits me. That was the best boss ever. That was just an amazing level all, all around. And we'll continue on. Now we're at the submarine. Um, just want to let you know guys, having the top open to your submarine doesn't um, really work. Unless your point is to put your submarine underwater and then totally be underwater and die. So, you know, whatever you guys want to do, that's, I'm just saying. If you guys want to fail, that's, that's your thing, but I, I don't want to fail. So I feel like I should have been able to jump up there, which I probably could have if I had been, like, a good player in this game. Alright, give me some weaponry or something. Wait, is this the spider? Yeah! Oh, I got some thing at the same time. So the spider... I haven't been able to see before. The spider has a special ability to climb on the top of walls. But it has no weapons, is the problem. See, so I should be able to go up there and climb, but I can't remember how to do it. I, I really want to do it, just to show you, but it's not working. So in conclusion, the spider's awesome if you know what to do. And I obviously don't know what to do. Oh, I can jump much higher than I thought I could. That's something. I don't know why I thought that was going to work. I am murdering myself on this one thing, and I've taken elixir and I died. That's sweet. It's, uh... What happens if I stay on the top of the submarine? 
Is there anything over here? Oh, there's a guy shooting at me. This is the best level ever. You just walk past everything. And a bunch of stuff happening below you. And then you climb up the side of the submarine. And there's like an enemy that you can't get to. They can shoot you, but you can't shoot them, and you can't go around that. So that's awesome. What's the point of like, making this long journey? When you think they would just put a wall or something, I could jump over here. It's like a door here somehow. Now, another uh, idea would have been to have me start inside the submarine, but you know, the top of the submarine closed. That's another idea, you know, but it doesn't work for how the engine made this game. So I got hit by the crab guy, or maybe it was a lobster. And, um. Why are there no enemies here? So, is it because I walked through the whole level already that there's nothing here? And I don't remember that being an issue before, that there was a wall here? Okay, I can't seem to get through that little tiny opening. And I can't walk through this wall. How, do I, how did I get past this last time? I must have done something awesome. Oh, I walked right through there. Yeah, that was awesome. So, most of the enemies are gone. Noticing. I mean, that was weird. I'm guessing I, I won't get another chance like that. Not unless I walk past everybody like I did, just did. But I don't plan on doing that again. Oh. Awesome. Yes. Take that, invincibility everywhere. And now I'm in the crab room. It's really kind of weird that there's not like, you know, some different music. Although this, this looks obviously like an enemy, like, like a major enemy. Should be able to freeze this guy, but there we go. It's like, I guess I don't have to freeze him, but oh, one hit and I'm dead? Awesome. Sweet! I kill him, and I even miss the item. I guess that was unnecessary. Okay, I'm gonna figure out how to get this spider guy, because he's going to kill me before I turn into a spider. Okay, so I turn into a spider. I'm gonna figure out how to get the spider guy. Spider. Vehicle special move. Spider. The spider vehicle's special move is to climb on the ceilings. Press down and the spider will crouch. Then press and hold A. And while in the air, press and hold up until you're on the ceiling. Okay, so crouch, press and hold A, and then up. Crouch, press and hold A, then up. I can do this. I press the select button, and apparently the select button takes you outside of the, the spider vehicle. Okay, so crouch A up. Ha! Sweet! Now I'm on the ceiling, and gravity is reversed, and I can go full speed right through all these enemies, and I can get a bell. Up, jump, down. Up, jump, down. Sweet! Um, down, jump up. And right through again. Three, two, one. Yeah! That was awesome. I'm so glad I learned how to use the spider. 
and that I got hit by a guy immediately. Twice. I am failing miserably. I didn't even touch him once. Oh boy. This is the best submarine ever. Why am I failing at this so bad? I did so much better the first time! <laughs> Uh, I'm getting good at this level though, that's for sure. That's the right time to get that, but I don't need it. I gotta hit him a lot though, that's the problem. And I keep jumping right into him. And I took away some of my life. And I got it all back! No, I got some of it back. Six... No! Okay. That was close. Oh, that's exactly not how it's supposed to work. Now I'm stuck behind him, I can't even do anything. Okay, maybe I've got some of this I can try. Maybe this thing. Can I... No. So not even that's gonna work. I gotta hurt myself again to get out of here. And I'm almost dead. And I'm not even at the crab, this is the worst! Or, or I guess it's a lobster. Come on, low G, man. Don't fail me now! You can beat him! One hit kill. It's like, all I can do is just die. That's like... My number one ability is to die. And to let him run into me. That's... Number one is to get hit by bullets. Number two is to let the lobster run into me. Here's a good place for running. I don't know why I didn't run before, now that I think about it, when I was on the top of the submarine. That was pretty dumb. It's like, the shots that go straight down keep me from walking past, like, the median. So I always get hit by him. Because I don't know what I'm doing. See, that, that was just stupid. That should not have even happened. Like there, I couldn't jump because of the timing. I think if I just get the timing right... One... Two, three, timing. One, two, and the timing's different. And that one I ran right into. Two, three, one, two, three. I just want to freeze this guy. But it takes so many hits just to freeze him. It's like, the freeze isn't gonna do anything to him, it's the pike that's gonna kill him, so. See, and then I can come and do this, and probably I will get killed while I'm doing it. And then he runs right into me. And, uh, that's wish. Oh, I did this different time. Should play the same time. Another one? Yeah. Um, after standing with that guy, so I don't know. Yeah, see, the red one makes my pipe strong. And it's not good at all. So, continue on. Get all these items. This one. This time for a reason. I should have got that. Yes. The blue insert life. It's like giving likeness. And now it's time to have full health. And battle the beast. And he runs right into me as the first thing. And I get hit again as my second thing. And I get hit again as my third thing. But I have double freeze strength, I think, so I should take fewer hits to freeze it. Which, you know, that's something. I was five, five times. I got him five times. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah! Look at me, I'm in an awesome pose, I got my stance. <sighs> On to chapter three. Well, I think I'm going to call it a day. Thanks for watching. Join me next time. Bye.